Hello everyone, so today I will be showing you or doing a quick tutorial on how to make a 9 circles effect. Uh, this is what a 9 circles effect is if you've never seen one. It's basically very flashy, something like this. Something like that. So, um, I'm going to be making a 9 circles level based on that. So, uh, I was before testing it out normally. And so, you want to copy this layout. Uh, you want to use, uh, you want to set it to the layer 1. And then you want to get this block. You want to make it sort of like this structure. And once you're done with that, you want to uh, you want to make it go two down, and then you can do the same thing with this. Uh, this is the solid one. Uh, this one. I'm using the solid one here. And so, <clears throat> once you're done with the structure, uh, you want to sorry, uh, you want to give it each. Uh, you want to give it each uh, their own group. I uh, you want to give it a group, three, four, five. Five should be here. There we go. So it's be looking like this. Uh, wait, is it working? It's not working, hold on. So, uh, the level I showed you, I'm not sure what happened, but it doesn't work there. So, I'm going to be copying uh, the pulse trigger. Just like that. Here. And then, copy. And there we go. You can just go back. And would you look at that. So we can set this to, uh, I'm going to keep it blue, you can set this to 1, you're going to want to set this to group, you can pause here and see what it looks like. Uh, you want to set it to group and make it hold to 10. Huh. Wait, that's a bit weird. Wait, wait. Oh, you also want to set the background to black. I almost forgot about that. Oof. So you also... Hold on. Yeah, I'm not actually sure why... Uh, uh, which part? This part, I don't know why it's not, like, uh, pulsing. Uh, only this part is. Um, if you know what... If you know why, please uh, put in the comments. So, uh... <clears throat> you might uh, have to watch another tutorial for this sadly uh, for the other part but mainly to make it look like this uh, you want to make a pulse trigger so when when the icon goes here then this will be activated simple it's 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 a bit simple I'd say you can do this for the same thing so it'll be like this and so with this, you also wanted to make it fade into black again. So you want to copy this also and then set it to black. And then just like that. And then just like that, you have a quick 9 circles pulsing effect. So, say if we copy this. Uh, say if we copy this. You put this a few more times, and this is what it'll look like. Very flashy, uh, you can see. And with the other part, it'll be even more flashy, especially if you keep it like this. But the last, uh, the last one I showed you, the stuff were distanced, so it was a bit, it was a bit calmer than usual. And then also with this, you can do background triggers such as. You can use the same pulse trigger, just set it to background. So it'll look like something like 
maybe let's put it to red then after this uh, yeah you want to uh, to get like the full flash something like that uh, you want to uh, by 0.1 so it will be something like let me just uh, put that there all right so it'll be something like this let's copy this and put that there boom and then it'll look like this yeah, very flashy. Um, you wanna. It's good to master the way of this to make it look better. The more practice, the better it'll look. Just like all stuff. And then it should look like something like this. So that's basically how you do it. Uh, you might want to watch other tutorials. It's good to get a lot of sources. And so remember to like and subscribe if you like this content. Or you don't have to. Just enjoy the video. I'll see you in the next one.